Now you're looking live at the Georgia World Congress Center and President Donald Trump will address the NRA convention this afternoon. We have live team two coverage of the presidential visit. Channel 2's Dave Huddleston is live at Hartsfield-Jackson where Air Force One should land in the next hour. But we begin this half hour with Channel 2's Taisha Fernandez and the protests taking shape. Taisha? Well, take a look around me. I'm standing in the middle of this protest. It looks like there's about 300 people here. The Georgia Alliance for Social Justice Organization is the one that put this together, and this is an anti-violence protest. You see people moving from Woodruff Park right now, downtown Atlanta. They are marching to the World Congress Center where President Trump is speaking. They want to send a message to him that... Georgia is one of the deadliest states for guns, and they want that to change. We spoke to one of the leaders of this uh, protest earlier today. Let's listen to what he had to say. We are out here sending a message to the NRA and, and President Trump that we're pushing back on the extreme gun policies that they're trying to implement in Georgia. Again, we're not against uh, the Second Amendment right to possess weapons. We are against high-capacity magazine uh, weapons, assault weapons, and silencers. There's no place for that. Again, this group is heading over to uh, the World Congress Center right now. They realize that they can't get very close, but they're going to march and get as close as they possibly can. We'll be out here for the duration. We are marching with them, following them. So keep it locked on Channel 2 Action News as this story continues to develop. I'm Taisha Fernandez, live downtown Atlanta, Channel 2 Action News. Thank you, Taisha. As they head that way, you will be continuing to follow that throughout the afternoon.